Hello fashion sewers, I hope you are well. I know it's been a long time since I put a video on my channel. I think this is the best one this year of 2023. And um, it is a request from yourselves of me putting out information on my community tab asking you what kind of projects you want me to refashion. The top one was dresses and then I do believe it was denim, den yeah, denim jeans and then men's shirts. Now I do have a few items to show you. I've literally just come back from the uh, charity shop. There's so many changes in the charity shops these days. Uh, one thing being that a lot of charity shops are up in their game when it comes to a charity shop. They're starting to look a little bit more like um, fashion stores. Yeah, you got to give them credit for that though. Um, but another thing that is a pet peeve of mine, there's too many fashion pieces in these shops. There's just too many. I struggle to find dresses. A lot of the dresses were polyester. Main content was polyester and I, I, I no, I, I, I can't do it. No, I really can't. So I found one or two pieces, not as many as I would like, but the spring summer collection is starting to come through. So I will be going back um, next week or, or the week after. Anyway, let me show you what I've got at the moment. I'll start with the men's shirts and I'll move on to the dresses and then the jeans. So um, these have literally been, I bought these last week. A couple more, but the week before. So these are this striped, stripe. Yeah, most of them are striped actually. Yeah, striped men's shirts. And um, like I said, they have been washed, so they just need to be ironed. So I've got this red stripe one. This blue. This is an interesting one. This is purple, and it's it's got a reverse side, which is like a toffee colour. So it'd be interesting for me to be able to use both both of these incorporated into a design. And this one. So that's all that I could find that were in really good condition. Um, like I said, they just need to be ironed. These men's shirts, I will make some tops, but I, I think I might be able to get enough, hopefully, as long as they're mainly cotton and do some dresses. So if you've got any ideas, please do let me know because it is all about you and what you want me to show you on my channel. Next is going to be this dre the dresses. This is a cute one. It's a really cute one. It's a mini dress. I think it's meant to have lining in there. Hopefully, oh, you can't see that too well, can you? But it's got this interesting thrill detail here and one of the reasons why I picked it up is because of this detail here. But I'm not going to keep this as a dress by adding anything to it. If anything, I'm, I'm going to be cutting, I've got one idea already, um, cutting this, the top part off. Mainly because what's inspired me for that is this jumper that I've had a while, for a while in my pile. And it's more the same colour as that. It's got an interesting sleeve knit design. Hope you can see that. So I want to incorporate those two into one project. There'll be a little bit left over from both projects, but I may be able to do something with that and maybe add it to it. I'm not really sure. So I think that's going to be my biggest challenge. It's going to be that one. Now the dresses, like I said, there was lots of dresses that were out there, but they were polyester type dresses. So the next is going to be this one, which I thought was really interesting because of the stripes. So for this, it'd be case of adding to it, maybe sleeves, maybe even shortening it a little, and maybe using a hem somewhere within the design of the dress. Um, if you've got any ideas, please do let me know. Next is this suit. It's a long coat and a matching dress. I'm, I want this to be two separate pieces, basically because I'm thinking, you can always change my mind, um, by 
adding some sleeves. It's, it's a nice shaped dress actually. I just don't think it, it needs a new identity so it's not teamed up or twinned with the jacket. So I want it to be separate. Um, basically I'm thinking the reason why it's going to be separate is you can create some amazing sleeves that goes onto this dress. Otherwise I don't think it really would be worn that much as a, in, as a suit but maybe a separate. So we've got that and then we've got the coat here. Now I have, did this years ago, a mustard yellowy coat with a matching bag that I did oh, three, four, five years ago and it has slits at the side and this kind of, I want that to probably inspire this design. So I'm thinking along those as this, um, those ideas but keeping with the slits maybe re removing the sleeves so and finally it's going to be jeans I got lots of jeans one minute so these are my jeans the jeans are a pretty good quality actually um, one tip I will share with you that if you are working with jeans and you're struggling to find good quality denim jeans, go to the men's collection. The men's section of jeans, it tends to be a lot better quality than the women's um, jeans. So yeah, these are quite a few men's, these are women's I do believe. So I will just put those there for a moment. That's quite heavy. So I've got those, so I'll just quickly show you what they look like just hope that it will inspire you to think of something that I can do with them thinking along the lines of a long denim skirt because that's very popular for this this year for 2022 2023 spring summer but we can make anything that we want can't we so whatever you are inspired by to let me know in the comments I would be really grateful I've got a black pair here there's the back there's the front they've all got interesting pockets which is something I love about denim jeans actually I do have quite a few men's denim jeans in my collection there's the back These are women's, it's about three quarter length pants. This would be nice as a, it's quite a, a low rise section here. It would probably be good, I'm thinking maybe as a, a wrap to the front, I don't know. You inspire me, hopefully you will, please do. And I've got this cute mini. I think I was drawn to the belt detailing and this here is quite interesting. So you can also think about, it doesn't have to necessarily be a garment, it can also be an accessory if you want to go down that route. The back. And um, finally, no, got one more after this one. Another denim skirt. That's got no pockets. Um, Finally, and a pair of jeans. I'm done. <laughs> so that's what I've managed to get from the many um, charity shops that I visit within my local area. I try to keep in my local area. It is looking as though I may have to go further afield, which I'm prepared to do, of course, but it's all about supporting your community, isn't it? Um, so, like I said, if you have any ideas, don't care how simple or how complicated or how difficult you may think the idea is, please put those in the comment box below and let me know which, which one I should do first, which is the first project you want me to start. Um, the cream dress. Anyway, yeah, just let me know which is the first project you want me to start and keep those ideas coming and I will see you in my next video. Thank you for watching.